Things that never happen, happen all the time. Hi, everybody, and welcome to the Pre-Accident Podcast Safety Moment. Thanks for tuning in. Today, we're going to talk about the fact that the unusual is only unusual until it happens. Then, it's incredibly usual. Did he just say terribly usual? I think we look at off-normal events, anomalies, variabilities in our system's performance, as if there's something that was destined to happen. And I guess retrospectively, that's true. After it's happened, it's already happened. But what I think is interesting is our ability to understand and manage stability greatly outweighs our ability to predict failure. Things that never happen, happen all the time. Unusual combinations of normal performance activities often happen, and when they do, that's when a worker is at their highest potential risk for some kind of failure. Now, one of the challenges is, is to understand and realize when a stable system is drifting out of stability. Now, you've heard me talk before about weak signals. I've also talked a lot to you guys about how understanding how successful work is done is important. Here's why. The failure that's about to happen retrospectively will have very, very loud and clear signals. Well, that's about the most obvious thing he could ever say because after the failure happens, everyone knows the failure is going to happen. It happened. The problem is before the failure happens, those weak signals oftentimes are confused with time pressure or confusing displays or poorly written work control documents or crappy production schedules or weird tack times or pressures that are on the system. Things that never happen, happen all the time. So I guess then we expect workers to be psychic? How can a worker predict something they don't know is going to happen? And if they don't know it's going to happen, how do they know it's time to predict it? The quick answer is they can't. They'll never be able to predict something that they didn't imagine could possibly happen. The challenge is, is that we create systems that are resilient enough that when the inevitable failure happens... There's recoverability. There's an opportunity to reverse what's happened and manage the consequence. It sounds easy. (laughs) No, it doesn't sound easy. It sounds hard, but it's a really, really different way to look at how you manage the unexpected. Organizations that are good at managing the unexpected are good at managing the robust and resilient ability for the organization to actually recover. So you're saying the failure is going to happen. What we manage is the capacity for us to have a safe failure. That's exactly right. We fail safely. If we can't predict it, the only option we have is to create something that manages the consequences of the inevitable outcome. We fail safely. That's the safety moment for today. Think about it. This one's a biggie. As always, thanks for listening. I really do like spending time with you. We have a great time, wouldn't you agree? Until then, though, learn something new every day, have a great time, and for goodness sakes, be safe. Crap! I was hoping I would get to say be safe. Be safe.